going on everybody? It's your girl Sneaker Mom here. Today I'm going to be reviewing the new New Balance 9060 Warp. Let's get into it. New Balance box, nothing spectacular, all gray with the silver NB on top. You got New Balance on this side, same on that side. But then we're gonna get to the front of the box, and as we all know, New Balance does not give us any description or colors of the shoe. So on the front of the box, it says 9060. So let's get into the insides. Open up the box, pretty much you got your same normal, just inside with the cream tissue paper with the NBs on top. That's pretty much it for the inside of the box. So let's go ahead and get into the main ingredient of this video, and that is a New Balance 9060 Warped. Okay, man, all I wanna start off by saying is finally, 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 I got them in hand. I've been looking for these for a couple weeks now. Wasn't able to hit when they came out on March 31st. They came out on, um. First they came out on Hibbits, then they came out on DTL, DTLR, um, and they was only a men's size and couldn't never find my size. They did come out on Hibbits in my size, but I guess by the time I looked on there, it was too late, they were so loud. So today I walked into my local DTLR, and what do you have? I got lucky they finally had these in smaller sizes for your girl. So I was finally, finally able to pick these up because I didn't want to pay resale, and I was just keeping hope that they would come back out on restock. And I finally got my hands on a pair. And these pair, this pair right here is very, very nice. To me, it gives me those Joe Fresh Good vibes for the uh, 9060 that came out when he first brought out. They give me that vibe just because of the colorway. But overall, man, it's just a nice, clean colorway. And I'm just loving all these bright spring, summery colors going on with the shoe. And plus, it's a 9060. We all know 9060s are very, very comfortable. And this, these right here are no different, but the colorway just does this shoe even more justice than it already has been doing us. So let's go ahead and get into the description of the shoe. Like I said, it's like a multicolor. They call it warped. I'm guessing because of the different ways the NB is going on the inside of the shoe. Just because of all these different colors. But if I'm wrong, you let me know in the comment below where did the name come from. A lot of people just call it multicolor, which that's probably pretty much I'm going with multicolor because you got a bunch of colors on here. But they all look nice. They all vibe very nice together. But like I said, the description of the shoe, you got this nice, like a greenish, like a tealish green going through our uh, front of the toe of the shoe. And it's nice and mesh coming across the front of the toe of the shoe. You got that hint of that teal, teal right here in that uh, leather material right here on the top of the heel of the shoe. Also, very nice, very clean. You got that hint of that dark gray. You got your New Balance symbol right there in red with that uh, silver on the um, top of the toe. Also, I think it got, well, it's not really reflective, but just uh, silver. We're going to flip to the side. Where you, as you can see, you still got this New Balance symbol right here. And it has like different lines going throughout. It's like a yellow and orange color right there. Very nice touch. Then you still going to go around to the side, to the back of the heel of the shoe. Where you got that normal 9060 hook. It comes on the back. I don't know the name of the hook. It's just, I'm calling it a hook because that's what it looks like. But I don't know what it's for, but overall, it looks nice on the shoe. So I'm guessing that's why I keep putting it on there. But very nice. It's got different colors, like a pink and a yellow. Kind of an orange color on the back of the heel of the shoe on the little hook right here. Then we're going to go up. We got the NB right here. And it's like a purple colorway and purple stitching on the back of the heel of the shoe. Still got those hints of that tealish green and that mesh also on the heel of the shoe. Also, then you got that nice teal suede on the back of the shoe, right there on the back of the shoe. Also, very nice, 
very very clean inside you just got new balance and this is where that warp come from if you can see how it's in there you got a little swivel giving you that little warp uh thingy going on going around the uh sock liner right here you got this nice purple color around the sock liner which is very nice nice color um on the top of the eyelids right here you just got a gray gray eyelids right there clean nothing spectacular about the eyelids but then we're gonna flip back to the front right here where you got these nice white shoelaces and yes they do come with extra laces, which I do love. I love shoes that come with extra shoelaces, come with extra pair of laces. But then right here on the tongue, you got 9060 in pink and uh, like a grayish color right there on top of the tongue. And it's still, the tongue is all suede. You can see that right there. Uh, also in the back behind the tongue, you still got a nice mesh material with that little black, dark gray hook right there on the uh, shoelaces. We're going to go right here to the mid. So you got this chunky chunky mid so that's what we know the 9060 are known for this chunky mid so to me it does the shoe justice i love it i love the chunkiness of the shoe it just brings the shoe out to me and plus like i said they're already very comfortable you got that absorb right here on the bottom of the mid so also but then you got this like bubblegum pinkish color um coming across the mid so right there and it's just got a hint maybe of a violet looking color but you got the pink and then you got those hints of that red right here on the little pods of the shoe also which is very nice very clean Flip it to the bottom where you just got those pies right there and those diamonds, those red diamonds, and you got that new balance right there and like that pinkish color right there on the bottom of the shoe. And that's, I mean, pretty much it with this shoe, but it's just clean and I love this colorway. I love how it pops. Oh yeah, let me flip back to the lateral side of the shoe where you still got that new balance in that warp uh, kind of end. You see how they got the new balance symbol right there in that red and yellow stitching, which is very nice test to the shoe also just a very nice shoe like i said y'all i love it the colorways and the way they put them all together it just give you those spring and summer vibes and i like it and this was the right shoe left shoe looks the same as that way you got your nice teal and pink and purple and orange and yellow going throughout the whole shoe it's just nice y'all let me know down in the comment below what y'all think about these did you try to go for them or did you pass on them when they came out y'all let me know down in the comments below like i said i got lucky walking to my local dtlr today dtrl today and i uh, was able to pick them up clean shoe very happy i was able to get they retail for 150 dollars which is not bad for uh, new balance because we all know we're getting those a1 materials and you're getting that comfortability within the shoe period just because it's a new balance and it's very clean but like i said they did come with these nice extra laces it's like a pinkish purple lace i think uh very nice I think they look very nice in the shoe also, but I might start off with just these white cream laces that they have in here now, but if I want a little extra pop, even though the shoe already has a lot of pop to it, throw these nice violet pinkish color uh, laces in it and it'll just bring it out even more. But that's it, y'all. Y'all let me know what y'all think about this. Like I said, New Balance is doing their thing. The 9060 line is just moving up and up. I mean, I know they had another colorway that came out with these. It was a cherry blossom. Really wanted those also, but struck out on those also. It's gonna try to wait. Hopefully they're gonna restock those like they did these, but until then, I got the ones I really wanted. Like I said, this is the New Balance 9060 Warp. I'm gonna compare them to the um, the Joe Fresh Good, just because of the colors. Even though this is a lighter uh, greenish color, it just gives you the same vibes on the bottom of the um, midsole. You got that nice pink on the bottom of the midsole, same as these do. So. To me, that's just great. Give me the Joe Fresh Good vibes when I saw these right here. And I definitely want them. Love the Joe Fresh Goods. Even better quality materials on the Joe Fresh Goods just because it's a collaboration. But I feel as though these right here, they could have been a collaboration too just because of this nice colorway and the way that, that they put the shoe together is just giving us collaboration vibes. But it's not. It's just a normal New Balance 960 that they put a nice colorway on. But y'all let me know down in the comments below what y'all think about these. Did you go for them or did you pass on them? Let me know down in the comments below. But that's pretty much all I got for y'all today. So if you're new to watching my channel, hit that subscribe button. Hit that notification bell so you can know when I post all my videos. Follow me on Instagram at sneakermom1721. Stay tuned to the end for that on foot. And until the next time, it's your girl, Sneaker Mom. Peace.